how are you all doing I, I i am still in botswana yeah and trust me this is gonna be my last video from botswana <laughs> i'm leaving i'm leaving the country this week by the way this is quite interesting knowing that this is a country that right after independence they never had even a single university in the country and guess what the people came together to build the country's first ever university and you know how they did it can, can you come closer you, you know how they did it each family member brought one a beast one person one beast what do you mean a beast a beast is a cow okay yeah so one, that what one, one one man one cow so each family brought a cow and then that money was raised uh, to build a university that is one of the best practices of fundraising in the african continent in fact in the whole world where the entire country came together donated a cow this cow was sold as meat to the european union and the money raised to build a university and it's out of this university since 1976 to 1978 that education in botswana has been free so in botswana you get paid to go to school just like that in botswana you get paid to go to university oh okay. in botswana you get paid even to plow in botswana is also free health free health yeah so, so everything shows, is free this just shows you the kind of governance that you have in this country you cannot find it anywhere on the planet <laughs> listen I, I i i don't believe i need to find a student to talk to <laughs> Hi. Excuse me. Hello, mommy. Can I speak to you for one minute? Are you are you are you a student of this university? Is your tuition free? I'm sorry. No, I'm. Is your tuition? Free? Can I just one? Don't worry. Second. Is your is your tuition free? Oh. Your tuition is free. Sponsored by the government. I'm sorry. I I just can't believe it. That's what I'm asking. I know you don't want to be on camera, but it's okay. But um, you mean you go to school for free? Do you get a? Uh, like monthly stipends or something did you when, when are you receiving the first one this month this month you got it already you finished it oh. on friday ah, this week friday so maybe we can be friends and give you half of your money <laughs> how much did they get paid how, how, how much did they, did they pay you every month oh, voice i can't hear you why are you so shy like you're on campus, so you get how much? 1.5. 1.5. And if you're off campus, you have to get more of that? You get 1.9. That's a lot of money. What do you mean? Like, even if you live off campus, you have to get more money? Yeah. By the government? Yeah. And they're talking about more than 16,000 students. And these are like eight class students. They passed from high school. What? Yeah. Nah, this is a good country to stay in, man. Like, you, you, so which means you are being paid to go to school. Basically. Be did you hear that? Yeah. Basically, <laughs> no money comes from your parents. So you just... Does it mean that from primary to school was free for you? Yes. How, what's the educational system here? It's, it's primary, secondary, and university. Wow. Where did you do your primary? I went to a private school. So which one? Yeah. So she went to a private school. Lapo's Lapo's in Lapo's 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 Oh wow! Well, See, you were in the Delta. Oh, when I was in the Delta, yeah. this is a rich kid then. <laughs> <laughs> this is a rich kid. No, really nice to meet you, and it's good to know that you go to school for free. Thank you. Thank what are you studying? Bachelor of Sciences in Mathematics. Wow! Oh, oh, Interesting. She's a smart lady. Too. Yeah. All right. Nice to meet you. Thank you. So this is a monument that is dedicated to the families that actually contributed a cow in order for them to build this university so i don't know if you can see if your family member's name is in here let us know in the comment section but much respect to all these people that sacrifice their cows in order for you and i to be educated freely in this university Wow, so, so many people. It's like the entire country then. Look at that. Like the entire country donated. This is beautiful, man. I've never seen any story like this before. This is definitely my first time seeing something like this. So let me pick up one name and pronounce it. So J.F. Rams, Ramsden and Family. Mr. and Mrs. G. Skeletu, 
yeah so that is a beautiful african story shows how if we come together even a dollar we can actually build something you know this should be a lesson to africans that you can't do things all by yourself you know africans are communal let me show you one thing that you all don't know we are the only race on planet earth that our hair does not grow single like we, our hair always grow together it means that we always have to you know learn to work together that's a, that's a, we are the only race there's no race on earth do your research and find out and even our hair is stronger so when we come together we are mighty this is an incredible story and i hope you all learn from it thank you